Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome to the video. In today's video, I'm, I'm going to go over the Nerf uh, Dino Squad Triceroblast. Basically, guys, this is a hammer action, a three shot blaster that, that's also a spring powered. And it also has a three smart uh, front yard system. So, guys, let's get into the boxing and the review. Included as the blaster, darts, and instructions. Okay, guys. Now, starting off at the at the front of the blaster. At the at the at the front, as you can see, guys, uh, there is no anti barrel lug because this is a diamond squad blaster. And and then, guys, look, we we want to put the bullets in. And, and the reason why this is a smart AR system is because the, look, when you put it left down right here, you can open it and then you put your bullets in. And they're already in, so. Well, they're not, they're not physically already in, but you must uh, put them in just like so, like that. And then we want, and then we want, and then we want to fire. This part up, and you have your blaster right there, a three shot. Only shoots once though, and you have your primer. Next, guys, you have your hammer priming handle right here. This is a hammer shot right here. All you have to do is a flick down. The strength, the strength of fire uh, for your blaster is pretty normal. Just, just as a wood. As, as you would expect with a four like other nerf blasters that have hammer shot uh, the priming handle part and next guys you have a trigger right here down here this at uh, a trigger pull it's pretty it's pretty a uh, good this blaster does not have slam fire next guys you have a grip right here it's kind of grip right here kind of reminds me of the a uh, nerf a uh, uh, zombie like a sledge fire and another gun i think i have like this it might be like the nerf rival s series a uh, saturn 2 so but yeah uh, uh in my opinion about the grip it's it's pretty cool i can imagine myself like this and now guys and then you have this a uh, big a uh, rear a uh, back slimmer right here it's like a really big uh, slimmer they put on any any, any single attachments so you can like put on like a little strap uh, to uh, what team you want Next, guys, you have your stock right here. This stock uh, holds ammo storage, so you can put any kind of uh, bullets uh, back here, like so. And then you have them in there. But guys, I I do not recommend you have them in for a long time, cause if you take them out for if you take them out uh, for them being in there for like a long time, uh, they might get like a little a uh, pinch inside the bullet. So it's a little weird, but it's alright with me. Next, guys, I'm going to begin to the firing test. And let's see how this blaster goes. guys so um that shot as respectfully I, I did not experience any gains in my functions with with the firing procedures or, or the firing test it was a uh, pretty neat it was pretty accurate for me and yet I like I, I like the blast when it shoots it's good for me now down to where how far it shot this blast is shot at about 63 feet per second which is kind of been a little bit low uh, for that uh, for that like elite par uh, that we uh, should uh, really expect from uh, from uh, fr uh, from uh, most uh, nerf blasters, 
but the uh, but the uh, blaster shot nicely though. Now guys, that in my personal opinion, oh, how about the blaster? Overall, guys, it's a it's a pretty cool blaster. I like I like the I like the design of like how they're trying to uh, make a new uh, blasters. But, but but basically, guys, these blasters right here, the Dino Squad series, they're basically based off for kids. But I I kind of like the new uh, Dino Squad um series. Cause they all looking like a dinosaurs, and I love dinosaurs. And I like how like they have one like just like a Triceratops. I I love it. I, I like how they, like they have like lever right here so you can put the bullets in. I kind of like that. It's kind of cool to have like some a dino a dino looking things a dino a dino looking guns out there that we can that, that we can now get. But yeah, guys. Um, this has been an awesome blast uh, to review. And um, I'm going to put a, a link in, in the description box below. And guys, I think guys, thank you for so much for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.